Hey guys, in this video I'm going to show how to install Selenium ID on Chrome browser or Firefox browser. So this is very uh, useful tool. So go to this website selenium.dev slash selenium iphone id. Once you are inside, right, so you need to download this Chrome download. So you will be redirected to Chrome web store. So here, right, I need to add this add to Chrome. So add extension. So Selenium ID has been added to Chrome. So it's cool, right? So now you can see the symbol here, Selenium ID for Chrome browser. So just click on this. You can verify this. If you want to create some projects, you can create it and open an existing project. I just want to simply run some URLs. Project name, I can use block. So the base URL I have to give that, STP slash account start recording so automatically the right under the browser window will be opening and whatever actions i'm doing that you can see in the recording sections so it started already recording so now you can see this um, now you can see the recording option is started so if you want to stop stop it i'm going to click something some doing some actions so see this is automatically it's open. So here it's perfect, right? I can use this to find elements as well. So when you click it right, you can see the export, export relative path, absolute path, CSS selector, everything you can find. So I can copy either link, say this is the link I can copy and you can choose that. I'm just copying this export. So I'm gonna use that in my code, drive and path. Find element by XPath. So these are the letters I can use it. So by XPath. You can double quotes. So once you copy it right, I need to give the action dot click. So this is the actions I just want to perform. I want to click the you, I mean some links. So it's gonna click it, run. It's opening the browser. So see this time it is clicking action. The action is performed and the URL is open. So I can put some either of thread dot sleep. So again gonna run. So super right, it is clicked. So it should close now. This is the way you can use Selenium ID for Chrome browser. This is an example. That's it. In my next video, I'll be showing how to do it on Firefox browser. That's it. Thank you so much for watching. Please spread comments and feedback. Thank you. Bye.